I want to say getting fruit into your diet is really so difficult. It tastes always delicious. But the green smoothies, that can be another step. Maybe for some a little too far, but it's all good because it makes you feel good. You don't need to have a coffee when you're on this. This is my most favorite green smoothie recipe. It's actually my only green smoothie recipe. I wouldn't really drink many others. I kind of came up with it by myself by putting loads of ingredients I like. Avocado is like my favorite top thing in the world, followed closely by frozen bananas. When you add frozen bananas to this, it basically makes it like a slush. And ideally soak your nuts the night before you're meant to use them in a glass of water. I went to this girl's place last weekend and she literally made this smoothie only because I was there. And I remember it was so funny because she put two huge tablespoons of wheat powder into her smoothie. You put a teaspoon max, she put two tablespoons and then she literally just had to down it in front of me, trying to look like it's the usual for her. But she only made it there because I was there. But really, have you gone to the green side? What I'm saying is, don't let me catch you out. I've got the perfect avocado to show you. Look at that. It just melts on your tongue. So this is my brunch. I usually miss breakfast and I start eating about lunchtime. That gives me a little bit more energy. It's better to drink the smoothie as soon as you've made it because it can tend to go a little grey after like half a day but this should be prevented because we're adding lime which is citric acid which is meant to prevent the oxidation of the smoothie with the air. This goes up to a maximum of 650 mils, but I always push it right to the top, so probably about 750. And that's like a kilo of weight. One guy was like to me, he was like, man, this weighs so much, like almost like a steak. <laughs> Original. But I also got a few optional ingredients you might want to add depending on your taste buds, but also on your ability to get the ingredient. Like for instance, malungai powder. Yet yeah, you won't have heard of it because it's actually from the tropics and no one's been shouting about it. So that makes me about one of the only people who's using it. But quite seriously, it's one of the best multivitamins out there because actually it's got 20 different amino acids, 46 antioxidants, 36 anti-inflammatory compounds and 90 nutrients. And that's not everything. For more info, look in the description down below because that's apparently how Popeye grew his big muscles. And obviously coconut oil, it's got a sweet aroma, which kind of just adds the tropics into your smoothie when you drink it. It's full of medium chain triglycerides, which basically when you're consuming this, it makes you slimmer. <laughs> yeah, and it's nature's antibiotic. What not to like? The price, maybe. Okay, so this is with the special ingredients, only just a little bit more green, but just as delicious. Yeah, that's really good. And have you even tried a green smoothie is my question, because I know most people haven't. And if you enjoyed this video, please do stick a like. Let me know what you would tweak in the comments below, but also what other recipes should we all know about? 
Thank you for tuning in to another Born Again and I'll see you next time. Oh yeah, and if you haven't subbed, then what are you waiting for? Peace.